I'm Rebus, and today I'm sharing with you all a Silver Surfer list that was recently piloted to a top four finish at the Impulse Tourney, which was a large tourney this past Saturday. Um, this deck was created and piloted by a content creator named Yo Woody. Um, he's been playing a deck similar to this for a while, and he uh, had a really, really good showing of it in the Stornia. Uh, obviously, among like uh, a couple hundred people, he finished in the top four. Um, essentially, it's a really heavy focused Werewolf by Night list with uh, some movement synergy. Right, we have our Craven, our Polaris, our Spider Man, and our Juggernaut to like all just add power uh, across the board. And then we have our counter cards of Ham, Shadow King, Killmonger um, to help deal with decks like Loki and Clog, uh, freeing up the board. All of these are on reveals for the Werewolf, so we're able to move that around, create a ton of power across the board. And then obviously, we have Sarah to throw priority and kind of give us. Um, I asked actually him directly, um, give us help versus Loki, right? <laughs> when they Loki you and you have Sarah out, your cards are going to cost the same. So as long as you're in a solid position to beat the Loki player, shout out right, shout out their collector, and you're ahead on board, uh, you should be in good spot after you Sarah. And yeah, we even have Snow Guard in here, which was uh, something that I haven't really played around too much with in any kind of surfer list. Um, it's an activator for Werewolf, gives us two more activators for Werewolf, and gives us um, a way to get rid of uh, pesky locations, right? Limbo, or get us into Cosmos, etc. Um, overall, so I, I did test it a while back, um, I think with Silk over Jeff, um, and then I played it a lot um, this past Saturday on stream, got two back-to-back -back Infinity tickets with it, feels really strong. Uh, if you notice, a lot of my decks recently have been running Dragonite and Shadow King. They're definitely huge, huge MVPs of this list. Uh, even Spider-Man with the Werewolf synergy is really strong. Um, so definitely don't underestimate that. That's generally like how you're looking to get the win, is you're going to win a lane uh, by Shadow King it down, and maybe having like some Surfer Polaris Spider-Man in that lane, and then using a big Werewolf to win another lane. Uh, or if there's not that much power on the board, you can use a Druggernaut to kind of just mess up your opponent as well. Druggernaut super crucial right now. It can help lock out your opponent's uh, board. can mess up their werewolf procs in the middle of the game. Obviously, if you play it on the last turn, it can lock them out of a location if they didn't fill the board that much. Um, and yeah, just really powerful options. The list can uh, counter a lot of different decks. And yeah, it feels really good. So I'll let you check out the games for yourself. I included one gold conquest in this video. And let me know what you think. Like the video. Um, if you enjoyed, uh, subscribe if you want to see more. I'll link your witty socials below. So definitely check him out as well. And I will catch you on the next one. Peace. Knowing that pop goblin is good too now. Yeah, man thing was just insane there. Someone has spent 1500, you don't want to give another 50. <laughs> Yikes. Well, this is interesting because I do have a bear. And I have Polaris here. I think it's like another hawk. Yeah, it does feel like that now. Someone has a deck that you've been using a lot. That's pretty cool. Oh, do I, how important is me playing Sarah here? I feel like 
So anyway, Snow Guard doesn't lock them out because we can send the hood over. I don't think we're bearing here. Bearing seems worse for me than for them. Maybe I just jug this turn. Like, they can't play Annihilus this turn, which is why I wanted to do this. I could move Jeff mid, but... Seems bad. The issue is I can't win here, right? I do this. How do I win here? It's only two power here. So they get minus one, they'll be at four. Wait. Oh, but then I can't play. They really went for it. Beats everything but sentry here, but if they sentry, they lose Central Park. No, I'll try this for one cube. Yeah. Cool. Last thing you need this meta, yeah. I'm not a fan of the, all the hawk list. Oh, it's the Dino Darkhawk list? Yeah. Iron Peace win. I'll be honest, I've never, like, I don't see that list doing well, but I'm, I guess I did well with it. Because it is, I do think it is bad into Loki, yeah, I agree. I think ideally I want Jeff on the left always. So they put their sentry. He can goblin mid, I guess. But... Take three Spider-Man here. Seems like people don't want to play Loki anymore. Uh, the tournament was like all Loki. They just didn't make top cut. Yeah, I could have snapped here. All right, all Spider-Man into big house. Come on, I need two more into big house. And I just win. Oh, come on. Big house. All right, all right. Fifty-fifty. Oh come on, man! Unlucky. Unlucky. Do you think they ever beat Silver Surfer here? Honestly. Like, what if I just go Silver Surfer next turn? 
Move drop silver surfer. I'm gonna snap. I actually don't think they can beat it. <laughs> like, these decks usually don't run Shang or anything like that. Man thing? Okay, that's fine. I'm giving up that lane. Yeah, Surfer should fill before Wolf moves. Right? I'm actually not sure. I think it does. They got to keep their Hobgoblin here too, which is nice. Yeah, Wolf should move after. I'm not gonna get more than two cubes, but guaranteed two cubes is probably worth it. And <laughs> things with trial, yeah. Like, it's only Sean that I lose to, right? No way they're running Sean with Hobgoblin. Shadow King doesn't do it. And they have Sean, like, sure. We'll find it out. Usually those decks have Shadow King, and that's it. Like, they still have Viper, right, for sure? And Eliath, most likely. Yeah. Victory. I would say it's fine to assume no Shaun. I mean, the Zabu is recent to assume, like, maybe they have Shaun. But they probably have a cage in there if they're running man thing. I think it's fine to assume they don't have Sean. Like if they snap me back, maybe I have to leave, but Yeah, like sometimes people just run it randomly even when it doesn't really fit the list. Wanna just rope me out there? Did they just leave? No. <laughs> They're just roping me. I mean, they're not a Hawk Liz, so it's kind of fine. Oh, Vats is nice. Oh, wait, not, not so. Oh, I need Killmonger, right? Because they're going to get a bunch of demons. It's like nice and not. <laughs> It's not nice as the demons that are going. I mean, I can deny them a few demons. It's like double players, right? Deny them one demon, I guess. Surprise there. They're, they're playing out the rocks, so I guess a Vanillus. They're trying to get. I have to play out a rock here. I just filled, sure. I'm just playing it. It's 14. Ouch. They're gonna have my Sarah Werewolf and Shadow King. I don't know how they didn't snap this, to be honest. Like, did they think they were losing here? Oh, they do- <laughs> Chat! <laughs> they do have Shag. <laughs> they just didn't draw it. Oh. We just hit the 25 percenter and they didn't draw it. Okay, that's good to know. Escaped. That was an insane draw from them. I don't know how they didn't snap there. That's such a good draw. 
Are you playing Conquest? Thank you. Yeah, I, I think Conquest is the most interesting game mode, like to watch, in my opinion. So that's why, I like, I also enjoy playing it, obviously. But glad that you guys like it as well. That was something I was worried about. The leaderboard is that people would get upset that I'm playing Conquest, but it seems like y'all are fine with it. Uh, I think this in Mojo World is worth more. How how much value do I get from knowing one card? Probably not that much, right? But they're also gonna. I mean, I can win Mojo World pretty easily. Yeah, let's put them in Mojo World. I want priority a lot of the time. Destroying a card is just not that useful compared to getting Mojo World procs. We lost Surfer. That's fine. I have the werewolf. You want to see me till online? <laughs> Check a W. This is borderline snappable. Not gonna snap just yet though. It's like technically they can lock me out of middle isn't a worry, right? It's a mad thing. It's not true. Like if they're giving me stuff, I'm winning the lanes they give me stuff, right? Snap a Sarah here. Druggerman, Drugging out and Spider Man means I should be good. I actually want a two drop off the top instead of the Killmonger. Mm, Nihilus mid is not ideal because they win mid by one. I don't know how they win another lane. How do they put four cards here? I feel like they literally can't. They, they haven't played the hood yet. Your Dragonaut is so good. Friendly neighborhood Spider-Man here. Drug carry, yeah. I mean, honestly, even if we didn't have the drug here, they played Black Widow's obviously. That's like ridiculously weak. The duck looks kind of busted. Yeah, it's pretty good. This was a matchup I was a little bit worried about on paper. Yeah, no, I'm not against Sarah. I like Sarah as a concept. <laughs> it's just in practice. Like, I, I've tested, like... Well, obviously, you've played a lot more of Sarah recently, but in the past, when I was running the surfer list, it the list always did better when I took out Sarah. As weird as it sounds, like, it just always felt better. As much as I didn't want it to. Alright, is this Shuri? Alright, Druggernaut is pretty nice in a Shuri matchup. But, oh, getting rid of the Sauron is good though. But uh, Shadow King is probably more important. Yeah, I'll see. I'm, I'm gonna play as is first, right? Obviously. It's the most important thing to do. Because it's been a while since I've re exploited this. Usually I run like a Miles in it instead, honestly. <laughs> and get rid of, rid of like one 3 drop for like Silk. 
Actually, usually I'm not running two ones. But I like I like the idea of running two ones with a werewolf. Like werewolf is not a thing when I was last trying to make this work. Pulling a one drop into the armor lane. You know, I was trying to pull the Psylocke that I knew they were going to play. Would he? <laughs> I, I actually forgot I had Killmonger because I also don't play with Killmonger enough. Uh, I should stop this though. Am I just Killmongering now? I feel like no, right? So Killmonger server next turn. That, I know what list they're playing. They're playing the Gosh list. It's it's like the Annihilus Shuri hybrid, where they like Psylocke out Shuri into Sentry into Annihilus. <laughs> Don't have a red school. I mean, it's fine. Uh, most of the time, ham is good in this matchup. Weirdly enough, like most of your hits are good. Your only bad hits are minima and red school. Everything else is a positive hit, so you always take the ham. Can I have my monger? Ugh. <laughs> Am I Polaris in here or Spider Man in here? It's not Werewolf, right? I think it's Polaris. Whoa, they played nothing? That's weird. This deck is not a good White Hot Room deck? No, definitely not. <laughs> but it's fine. It's a good anti White Hot Room deck, surely. I guess they're planning on shurying 50 50 to pull it off. Oh, they have priority. What am I talking about? But how did they have prior there? Because of my Polaris's? I need my Killmonger. Okay, I can fill White Hot Room now, which is nice. I should avoid priority. This deck doesn't run Elias, to my knowledge. So I think I'm staying. I guess both of these are going over here. I only have 18 there. I'm gonna leave. I'm just gonna hope one of these goes over here, right? 50 50. I'm gonna play it out for sure. All right, I need one to go into White Hot. Okay. This deck doesn't run Annihilus, right? There's no way with armor. I want to snap back really badly. Shadow King, Shadow King, Surfer, Surfer, Snapback. Alright. YOLO! He said Snapback, so we snap back. He is. He is the deck builder. I have a Nihilus Ron one? Yeah. 
It is the deck builder telling me to do the snap. They played Hood and Annihilus. Bro, that's gotta be like the weakest line in the entire deck, no? Ain't no way. Alright, I'm beginning to think the Gosh deck is not good. <laughs> Come on, man. Jeez. Savage, man. Yeah, I'm at a lot, sorry. Uh, bro, the fact that they both are like the same sounding syllable is gonna kill me. Mobius. <laughs> I, I, I don't know how they decide the prices on these things, man. It feels random sometimes. Martyr is Silk with less steps. Martyr is way worse than Silk Chat. Silk doesn't die to uh, Killmonger. Alright, so there's some sort of junk deck. Might be bad that I lost Shadow King. Depends if they're... Oh, maybe they're not junk, right? They could be, um... Could just be Bounce. Mad they changed the price? Yeah, I think most people are mad they changed the price though. Yeah, they're like werewolf bounce, so showing off the Shadow King kind of sucks here. Do this into Sarah. They upped it from 5 to 20 bucks. The bundle got bastard. Whoa! There's a white tiger in their deck. It's a Ravona deck. That's what that means? It's I think it's Ravona Hawk. They're cooking? Yeah, they're cooking. I'm very happy with my hand, which is why I'm snapping this. Nihilus! Madge. Hey, this is really good here. Gives me up some space. I'm gonna hawk so they don't get super low value. Jeff for fun. No guard, bear, spider man. Hopefully, I get another three drop. Surfer is the best draw. Is it Annihilus Verona? Huge Killmonger. I mean, they should be leaving. But if they're not... Okay. <laughs> Retreat now, gamer. Let's go. If they're not, I think it just needs to split power evenly. It's not worth it anymore. Uh, unless you really want the variant, yeah. Probably not worth it. Am I hamming here? I think I am. Retreat now, gamer, to impulse finals. Oh no. Alright, let me actually get rid of the Torny title. Ooh, that's a really good hit. Bro, Ham's been super goaded. Oh, 
What's up now? Am I win? Oh no. Disaster. I mean, maybe they're just tilted from playing for so long. Nice, this one. I have Killmonger here, which is why I'm pretty confident with snapping. Got another Juggernaut here. I guess I could get another Killmonger. This is better, right? Oh my god, they're negative. What? Excuse me? What do they have in there that they're negativing? That's actually really scary. You say they're cooking? I, I. They have Iron Man. Okay. Iron Man. Oh, wow, Surfer was the worst pull. I mean, it's okay, I guess. I guess that explains the white tiger now. Can they fill here? Some prio? Do you think they're running a lioth in there? I don't know about Kilmire, it's literally on the board. I'm gonna stay, it's a little risky though. I mean, I could mean, I just kill Monger the hood. I think it's this Mystique and Eliath. Yeah, people don't, people don't uh, bluff, right? I should just leave. I, I should leave until I know what they're running, right? It, it's not, it's not worth the eight cubes. It would be worth four for sure. It's not worth t staying on a turn six snap, I don't think, ever. Especially into negative. Super scroll. Like once I figure out all their cards. We know they have Iron Man. So I'm just missing one card from them. Honestly, I feel like I could have gotten away with that last game, but Oh no, actually Iron Man's on the tracker. So it's just scroll scroll and two other cards, right? Wait, I I do feel like one of them is At Nihilus. I would be surprised Mystique to be honest. That could be Mystique, yeah. Alright, I can dump everything and then Hawk and I should win. Am I holding Killmonger now? 
Didn't they just give up that lane? Oh, I guess they were expecting the bear. Killmonger wins here. I shouldn't Polaris here, right? This guy wins left? Yeah, Killmonger wins left though. And this throws Pryo, so I can Shadow Gang. Could die to Eliath. But so I should swap these, right? Wait, that kills their Iron Man. I, I think I've discovered some anti-synergy with their deck chat. <laughs> what is going on here? My my opponent is realizing that they can't annihilate us with Iron Man on the board is what is going on. <laughs> I mean they lost the lane anyways. <laughs> it's just funny. Who would shame concede that so bad? Yeah. That's something I didn't think about, but like, that's kind of huge, no? Alright, is this a situation where... I'm gonna snap after I show the Graven, I think. Yeah. I just want to make sure I don't get wrecked by uh, like deep space. Dragonaut has a ton of value this game, but I'll play it next turn. Shoved it. I mean, they built their deck around the Nihilus a little bit. They have like Viper, Widow, all this stuff, right? Alright, hopefully we hit them into. I mean, Deep Space or Left is good, right? If they're playing negative here. Deep Space is better if they're playing negative. Century. Alright, left was better. <laughs> That's still fine though. Surely it's still fine. You can hawk here, right? Is there a need to though? 
I'm trying to think if I can ever win here. I don't think so. I think I just need to fight for here. A hawk and go. The Monger Surfer, which was not enough. Put the Iron Man here, it's a little bit sketchy. Plus nine, I go to 16. Can they beat 16 here? Not with cards I know about. Maybe they'll annihilate CN. I don't think so. If they do, that would be pretty funny. Chavez? Maybe. The Chavez in your negative deck would certainly be something. That's interesting that leader copies the werewolf into that lane. I would not have expected that. <laughs> leader guy. Dude, they're cooking. Their deck's hilarious. It has a ton of anti synergy. Their last card is Super Scroll, by the way. So they have no Mystique. Yeah, we got the whole deck. Like, their negative is only good on Iron Man, Leader, and Scroll, and White Tiger. And then the rest of the deck is just Clog. Yeah, I didn't know Leader copies were Roll of Jumps. It makes sense. But it's weird. That means it also copies where Spider Man goes? But, oh, I guess it would go on reveal again and jump. Interesting. That's like important to know if leader ever gets back in the meta and you're playing werewolf on turn six, but such like a small <laughs> thing. But yeah, I, I, I would expect it to copy in the original lane, but I guess priority matters. I think for Ghost Man. I don't know why I didn't show up in chat. 